first alert weather with Cassie Campbell is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. We are almost halfway through this heat wave. Once we get through today, we'll be almost to the end. We are still tracking that first alert action day through tomorrow. That excessive heat warning goes until Friday evening. So that heat index is still expected to be pretty brutal through the rest of the work week. But hey, comfortable conditions around the corner. It is going to really shape up to be a nice weekend towards the end of the weekend starting on Sunday and into next week. So let's walk you through what that looks like right now looking at our satellite and radar. Pretty clear and dry across the heartland. Seeing some high clouds lingering across which could cause a little bit of some overcast skies but for the most part not a whole lot of cloud coverage and we're pretty dry just really hot and humid that's been the story that's going to remain the story for the next few days so futurecast here is starting around nine o'clock this evening still tracking a little bit of those overcast skies headed into thursday morning pretty dry clear a little bit of sunshine expected throughout the afternoon which is going to feel the current temperatures are going to up just a little bit, but we are starting to see those dew points gradually head back down to the mid 70s. So hopefully it doesn't feel as sticky as what we've been seeing yesterday and into today. Thursday night clear across the heartland rolling into Friday morning around 9 a.m. A clear start for if you're headed off to work or getting those kids on the bus, maybe heading to school for them. It should be a good start. It's still going to be warm and pretty muggy so make sure they have a way to stay hydrated and stay in the AC as much as possible but our main story again is going to be this excessive heat warning issued for all of the heartland this goes into effect through Friday around 10 p.m. on Friday night still tracking the chance for that heat index anywhere from 100 to 100 maybe enjoy a cold treat. I wouldn't wait too long to enjoy it. We are seeing a puddle. A puddle in seconds is what our melting forecast is looking like. So if you do step outside and try and enjoy it just for a little bit, I would do it quickly and then head back inside where that AC and where you'll feel much cooler. Lows tomorrow morning already kicking off in the mid 70s across the heartland. 74 in Paducah, 76 there in Marion. Highs tomorrow afternoon reaching into the upper 90s. Hopefully those dew points aren't as bad so that the heat index, so what it feels like outside, isn't as terrible as what we've been seeing. But it's still going to be pretty miserable throughout the rest of the work week. 98 in Marion, 99 in Mount Vernon, 98 here in Cape Girardeau, 99 in Fredericktown. But that forecast is looking pretty warm still through the rest of the work week. 98, 99 on Friday. We do have a cold front that's going to start sliding through on Friday which is really going to set us up for maybe some rain chances headed into the week and a little bit of some pop up showers, but really looking at those much cooler and comfortable temperatures headed into next week.